What's up guys, I'm back to do um, another video for the DSi sound option for the DSi, obviously. Uh, so let's just start that up. So, first of all, as you can see, if you can see this top part, uh, there's like waves while I'm talking, so it picks that up. You'll hear the parakeet talk really quick, just ignore that. It's pretty annoying actually. So you have a uh, record a sound option, or the play with your sound, with your music option. And if you see, if you press that parakeet, it'll take that sound you just talked about, whatever. So first I'm going to record a sound. So I've got all these different areas to record a sound. I'll just pick this first one. And I'll start recording. Twisted Foo Sucks Fat Hairy Dick. Okay. So... Let's we'll just take that. <laughs> Sorry for you uh, younger kids watching out there. But you can take this. Twisted foo sucks fat, hairy dick. And it plays that. Or you can press this option. Make your, you can make your uh, voice sound really high. Or you can make it really low. You can make it slower and low, or slower and lower, slower and higher. Make it faster and lower, faster and higher. So you know I, that's a pretty cool option. Then you can make your uh, your recording sound like a parakeet, like a robot, like helium, like if you. Inhaled it. And over here you can uh, make it like an electric fan. Like a tunnel with echoing. Like a transceiver. Walkie talkie. And all these like harmony options. Then like a trumpet. Whistle. and a buzzer. So those are just like a couple different options that you can play around with with the recording. I'm going to delete this because I don't want it. And then we'll go back and I already have my SD card inserted in here and you can listen to music off your SD card with the DSi. So I'll open this up. So, as you can see here, you can listen to all your songs. I have uh, only the Super Smash Bros. Brawl soundtrack on here right now. So, um, I don't know, what should I pick? Let's just do... Airship Fortress. Or... We'll do this. So, um, as you can see here, you've got a lot of different options like the other menu. Up on the top screen, you've got a visual player. And if you press this right here, it changes the visual player to like different things. You got Mario and different visual players. I think they're pretty cool. Uh, sorry for that weird quality. That's what happens when you're zoomed in so much. But yeah, the visual players are pretty neat. I like the this one. <laughs> it's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, so you've got that. You can also add in your own touches to the music, like a drum or a snare. But that's it, that's a snare, but or this bass. And then you can also do all the different things that you could do with your recording, like higher or lower, slower or faster, or anywhere in between. You know, it's just fun to play around with that. Here you can make it sound like a radio. Make it just instrumental. Have an echo. You can also make it sound like an 8-bit game, which I was really excited about, but it doesn't really sound too well. Just listen. Kind of just screws everything up. 
So, I don't like that option that much. And then you can also add in your own uh, recordings on this for this option, but I'm not going to do that. And you can add it to your favorites if you want, but that's basically it with the uh, DSi sound. Just leave that playing here. Uh, it's pretty cool. For a music player, if you don't have one, like an iPod or something, it, this works out really well. I'm going to use it as my main music player because I don't have an iPod. I used to use my PSP, but I like this better now. And I have a 4 gig SD card, so... This is a, a DSi sound. is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. And finally, for my last video, I'm going to just go over the DSi Opera browser just to show you guys that. So uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy this video and check out the next one. Thanks for watching.